What's your favorite versus least favorite part about being a college athlete? Least favorite is probably time management, the stress and anxiety that comes with everything, and just the extra pressure you get. I feel like I have no time. Like, this is a joke. Some professors, if you have good professors, they give you leeway and they help you like, oh, no, I understand. Like, you could do this and I won't do this, right? Some of them aren't like that, though. And that's the problem <laughs> where I struggle because I'm like, ugh. Bro, I remember I was at Eastern and we are playing in a game. We went to overtime. And in my head, I'm like, dog, I have a whole excitement to do. And then after the game, I scored the like, I think I scored the game winner, like, first ever, like, game winner. After that, I grabbed my food and I ran to my room and I had to do my homework. Yeah. After a game like that, I said... You're like, you want to chill, right? Exactly. I was like, what is this? But, yeah, the time management is tough, man. It's tough. You're given this opportunity. You want to show people what you can do. You want to showcase your talents. But sometimes that doesn't happen. So now it's like your mind. You're like, am I really good? Why am I here? Da, da, da. But you're putting so much stress on yourself because the season is, like, two weeks. Two, three games a week. It's crazy. You want to do something, but it's not. It's not feasible. College, bro, you're not eating. You're you're not eating right. You're not sleeping right. You're not you sleep. Know. You're never gonna sleep right. You try to ignore the fact that you're not getting the right things for your body. It grows on you. It's like it's like a tab. It just keeps yeah. going. And now you see your bill. You're like, damn. At the end of the year and stuff, people get burnt out. Remember, my teammates are burnt out. Everyone's like, I'm tired. I'm done with the season. And it makes sense. Like it's hard. I think favorite part though is just the fact I get to play. Once that ball is with me, there's nothing on my mind. And I think that's where I realize that's my passion. Nothing compares to when I have a ball on my feet. It's like the only stress I have is. I can't breathe. Like, I'm tired. You know what I'm saying? I kind of admire when I'm tired because I'm like, at least I'm playing. At least I get the chance to play. There's people that wish to play that just can't play. Yeah, that's why I always look at it. I'm like, you know, there's people in wheelchairs that literally can't walk. So it's like, you know, I get the opportunity to play, you know? I really reflected and I'm like, dog, I am so lucky where I come from and stuff like that. This does not really happen. It's probably one or two people that it happens to. I put work into it, but it's luck, man. It's so I'm so lucky. It's hard work and luck, you yeah, know? Yeah, man. The reason why I'm here is because one of my best friends, Derek, brought me here. We became good friends, and he realized that I was a good person, and then he wanted me to come with him. Like, it's little things like that, but that's luck. What if I never met him? You know what I'm saying?